Hey guys, I'm Preet and this week on Mostly Money, we're tackling an issue that would make motivational speaker Matt Foley lose his cool. People who don't take advantage of employer matching for their retirement savings, also known as people who don't like free money. If there was such a thing as the 10 financial commandments, you'd probably find the following items on that list. Don't spend more than you earn make your savings automatic, and never carry a balance on your credit card. But another one that deserves to be on that list is this. If your company offers to match your savings to a retirement plan, take full advantage of it because it's basically free money. Here's how these plans work if they are offered by your company. They will generally tell you that for every dollar you contribute to your retirement savings, they will offer to match it up to certain limits. As an example, they might say they will match at 50%, all your savings up to a maximum of 4% of your salary. That means that if you were earning $50,000, you could save 4% of that or $2,000 that would be eligible for matching contributions from your employer of $1,000. Now, some companies will match dollar for dollar or 100%. As another example, let's say your company will match 100% of your contributions up to 4% of your salary. Again, assuming you earn $50,000, that means you could contribute $2,000 per year into this plan and your employer would kick in an extra $2,000 per year as well. Now, let's assume you're 25 and you get a 2% raise per year and the rate of return on your investments is 5%. When you turn 65, your retirement portfolio would be roughly $720,000, half of which was because of your employer's contributions. In other words, in this simple example, the employer matching program was responsible for $360,000 of your nest egg. All you had to do was get off your butt and sign up for it. Okay, I'm gonna leave you with some final thoughts. If you're not a personal finance nerd, then all you really need to know is you should likely be taking full advantage of any employer matching programs at work for retirement savings. If you are a personal finance nerd, I'm gonna leave some links in the description down below to further discussion and spreadsheets on this topic. Keep in mind, you have to be on the YouTube channel in order to see the description. As always, if you have any questions or you wanna chime in with your own tips, please leave them in the comment section down below and thanks for watching. Hey guys, thanks for watching Mostly Money. I hope you enjoyed today's show. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel by clicking on the button in the bottom right hand corner of your screen, the little thing that says subscribe. There are lots of videos to explore on my channel, like this one. So if you want to learn more about money and personal finance in a fun way, check those out. If you have any questions for me, you can reach out to me on Twitter, at Preet Banerjee, or you can leave your questions and comments down below in the comments section. That's it for today. See you next time.